Hello everyone, and welcome back to Space Engineers. I'm your host Val Death. And we're playing through the tutorials. Next up, tutorial 9, Ship Flight and Tools. This tutorial offers instructions on how to fly a ship and use the three ship tools. You must use each ship in turn to navigate through several chambers that demonstrate how to grind, weld, and drill, as well as how to stock a weld ship's cargo and how to dock with connectors. So there you go, your three tools you can have as an astronaut, you can also have in a, in a ship. Alright everyone, here we are. Let's get going. Alright, enter the Sapper Grind Ship. By looking at the cockpit until you see a yellow highlight, press T to enter. When in the ship cockpit, turn on its reactors by pressing Y, because it'll be off by default. It's this ship right here. Oh, that's cool. It's more effective to slow down using dampeners and manual thrust. Uh, remember that from the last time when flying flashed. Remember to give yourself some time. Don't forget to use dampeners, that's the Z key. So you can see it's got some uh, grinders on the front there, tear stuff up, so the good old saw blades, bunch of thrust, and some spotlights. Alright, press Y to turn on all the reactors. Power is on. Basic controls, uh, that's the same as we've seen before. L to turn on the lights, they're on. Alright, what do they say? Press V to switch between first person, free look, V twice to reset, yep, 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 yep. Can free look while we're in here. See our cool ship design off to the side, our blue lights. Use the ship's grinders to cut a hole in the red armor wall big enough to fly your ship through. Alright, you can see we got here, uh, turn this on, three unlock. <laughs> That's awesome. We check our inventory. And we're getting cargo, getting steel plates as we grind them all up. All right, we need some more. More room. Oh yeah, very cool. Could probably almost fit through that. Okay, let's roll. We'll get both of these. Now we should be able to fit. Fly the shepherd, the this ship into this hangar bay, then exit the ship. Lights will turn on to indicate the ship is far enough inside. Turn off the grinders. Uh, turn off the reactors and hop out. Okay. This door can only be opened when the sapper grind ship is inside, which it is. It's all lit up. No. Oh, that's awesome. Finish welding the drills. 
at the front of the ship and the reactor thrusters at the rear of the ship. When the drill sh ship is fully repaired, unlock the landing gear by using the nearby button panel. You will also need the reactors turned on once you're in. You need to be using the weld ship to finish repairing the drill ship. You need to use the weld ship to finish repairing the drill ship. Okay, okay. So we'll go and get in. What does this one say? To use the weld ship tools, hold down left mouse button or press number two to turn the weld tools on. The tip will turn red when the weld tools are active. They're automatically pull needed components from accessible storage. Components. Find components here. Oh, but they must all be connected somehow. Through this connector right here. Okie dokie. Turn the welders on or off. Turn our reactors are off. Turn the reactors back on. Oh, cool, it just automatically welds whatever is around it. So this is the one that I wasn't reading, really reading very carefully. I need all the components out of here before I disconnect and try and start welding. Duh. I had steel plates from before and that was, that was what was up. So come in here, inventory, connected inventory. I want to move this to the ship here, so. No, I'm just gonna kind of do this. All right, so let me move everything around. Move all this stuff in. Yeah, I gotta do it like this. Um, and I'll be back. I'll repair that stuff, and we'll move on to the next part. All right, we're back here. Got this thing fixed all up again. Um, basically, I just didn't disconnect properly hitting the P and then moving away from the magnetic pole of the connector. So I had taken out the uranium from the <laughs> power of the station, which was why I, things weren't working. Anyway, I re-got it working here and I just need to come over here and switch the lock on that guy. Come in here, turn on his power. You can also use the number three key there for the unlock. Um, it's it, that's He's mapped it to that or the P key. Does the same thing. So unlock. There we go. Now we'll use our mining to come in here and mine. We need to put ore in here, the refinery. Uh, pull ore from accessible inventories. To dock, you need to line up the ship. Uh, the port on the top, press P to connect them together. So the opposite of what I just did dock it once I mine some more. Whoa, spun really fast there. Alright, up, 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 up here. Let's go mine some ore. Uh, mine this ore with the geode strip. You don't need to mine the entire block. A small amount is fine. To use the drill ship, turn on your drills or hold the mess button. One. I like turning on the drills like that. And then just walking up to it. Oh, that's awesome. Two thousand ore, two thousand iron. Oh, that's very satisfying. Very satisfying. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but just uh, making big holes and things makes me happy. Whoa! A lot of spin. 
spin on this ship. Alright. We just gotta line ourselves up. Look at that yellow, the magnetic connecting. Now press P, and they're locked, locked together. All right, everybody. While well, we're back, got them reconnected. Left the power on. It's doing its thing. Pumping the ore from the conveyor to the refinery. Refinery's outputting the ingots, dumping the ingots down in there, and that's what it needed to open the door. Door head is locked to position with landing gear. Landing gears are damaged and need to be repaired before they can be unlocked to allow the door to open. Use the weld ship to fix the landing gear. When the landing gears are fixed, this button panel will open. Ah, these two landing gears there. Okay. So I gotta go get the weld ship. That I just left right here. Alright. Finish this bad boy off. That's why I had extra components. Okay. Alright. And let's do it. Put one to unlock. And two to open the door. Exit. Oh, the ship's on the way there. That yeah, looks good. Objective complete. Woo! Tutorial success. Flashing green lights. Thank you guys for watching. Sorry for all the pains, but hey, that's what this tutorial's gonna teach me. The undocking button. P. <laughs> that's really what gave me problems. And turning off the reactors when I was connected to the station, which then turned off the station's reactor. And I couldn't figure out how to turn it back on. So, because I couldn't find it. So there you go. Thanks for watching. And we got one more tutorial left in the series. See you guys next time.